Welcome to a video on condensation, deposition, and sublimation created by Riley Cummings of Period 5 Chemistry with Mr. McLean. Condensation is uh, the change of liquid vapors back into a liquid. This occurs in the atmosphere when warm air rises, then cools, and the air condensing back into a liquid, forming rain. A good example of this process is when on a hot day your cold soda will seemingly sweat. The water molecules in the air hit the colder can and condense back into a liquid. Like that. Deposition is when a vapor goes directly to a solid, skipping the liquid stage. Deposition is the opposite of sublimation. Snow is created in the atmosphere when water vapor turns directly into ice in the atmosphere. And here's a turtle on top of some snow. Sublimation is when a substance goes directly from a solid to a gas without passing through the liquid phase. A real-life example is dry ice. Dry ice is the solid form of carbon dioxide when it sublimes or returns to gaseous carbon dioxide. It emits sub-zero temperatures that, when in direct contact, can cause frostbite. Another example of sublimation is an air freshener. It usually involves changing a solid into an aromatic gas in order to remove odors from a room. Here's an example of dry ice. And here's an example of some air fresheners that might sublime. A sample question for condensation might be when water vapor decreases the temperature below its boiling point or point of vaporization, what is that called? Condensation, because the water molecules recondense back into a liquid. And then there's a video involving two people discussing condensation. And that's all I have.